Hello, my name is Wilson Malone, and I'm a fish and wildlife technician with the Alaska Department of Fish and Game. I'm going to explain the research that we're doing on the Kenai River. Our sampling site is located on the lower Kenai River and is confined to a quarter mile stretch where the fish are sampled. Gill nets are the primary equipment used to trap the fish temporarily and then release them once they've been sampled. The target species are sockeye salmon and king salmon. This individual pictured is a dolly varden and will be released immediately. We take scales and fin samples to determine the age of the fish and generate a genetic profile for the river's fish. We usually work with a team of two and sometimes three people aboard the boat. Sometimes a fish can get very stuck in the net. It takes a bit of work to get them out. A bit like solving a puzzle sometimes. Here we have a king salmon striking the net. This is an average size individual. Using the scale samples we can determine how prevailing ocean conditions can affect the fish's age and size when it comes time to migrate upriver. The king salmon are placed in a specially designed cradle to perform the sampling and are released afterward. Three scales and a piece of their dorsal fin are removed for the sampling. We usually take about 10 minutes in between drifts. For sockeye, a piece called the axillary process located under their pelvic fin is removed to provide the genetic sample. 